Hey guys, this is Yvonne John and welcome to my first unboxing video. And today, I will be unboxing the Xbox One. Alright, so first we gotta take off the box, and it slides down like this. First thing that's in front that everybody will see is the Kinect sensor. The wires inside of this. Just gotta take off that. And leave everything so I can put this back in here real quick. You may be wondering what this is. Take off the tape in the back of it. Then we open it up. It's the controller. Now this is different than the Xbox 360 controller because the button is up here. And those shoulder buttons and the triggers are curved where it feels better. There's vibrate there's vibrators up in here, down here, all through the controller. The buttons, they they look like the same but they're bigger. The controller the control the control sticks have more grip on it and the D-pad is curved inwards. The buttons, there's not start and back anymore. The back button is now two little squares. And then the start is three lines. So that's what the controller looks like. Now, I'm going now to come back over here. We have the Xbox One headset that comes with the console. Now, this comes with the headset and it's it works perfectly. It, it's fine and it looks it has these green right the screen right here and this will block out any extra sound. Then it comes with a mic that just sticks out for you. And then with the controller, this part will plug into the controller. This one's different than the Xbox 360, again, because it's different. There's a mute button, volume up, and a volume down. They all are just buttons, and you plug this part into the controller. Let's plug it in real quick. And it goes onto the back just to secure safety. And that's what it looks like on the controller. And then when you're playing Battlefield or something, and you turn up your volume, turn down your volume, mute your mic so nobody hears you. And then, yeah, just play. All right, so next thing in the box, you get a free Xbox Live. I'm not going to show you the code. Here's some wires for it. Okay. Here's an HDMI wire. Then we'll just set open on. Okay. Here's some HDMI wires. They have little plastic on them so they don't get hurt. That's nice. Set so the wires right here. And then we have the power outlet, which we have to take on the back right here to get out. It's kind of big. We, all we gotta do is just take off this little part right here. And then the plastic will open for you. And then pull out the big box. And then what it looks like. There's where this part plugs into. Here, let me take it out of the plastic. It's another one of those black things that was on the other one. So, we just gotta get it off. Here's the big power outlet. This is Xbox right here. And then when you plug it in, there will be a light that comes up. Alright, next thing. First of all, let's take off this part right here. And we shall get the connect sensor. Some wire for it. You need this plug in, you need this plugged into the Xbox to run it. Many people complained about that, but I don't see it as a problem. Here's the connect. 
it's it's way different than the Xbox 360 because there's the Xbox right here that lights up when it turns on and its voice commands are a lot better take off the plastic real quick right here this little part right here and there's another one that's what it looks like without the plastic shiny in the front there's, a, there's speakers right here then there's this thing right here on the bottom to hook it up to something and then there you go that's the connect and then all the way back here this part plugs into your Xbox it, this, the, it has a little it's curved right here and then it has a little case for it it goes on like that and that's how you keep that's another way to keep your connect safe and then here we have the power cord that goes into the wall that connects to the big power box. Right. Let's take off these. I'll plug it in and show you how it works. Okay. Get this part off. All right. So. This part right here, this is the wall plug, and then this part plugs into your big box, just like this. And make sure that's right. Yep. Plug it into your power box. And then, there you go. And then... Plug this part into the Xbox One, and then this part into the wall. That's your power box. Then, the moment you guys have all been waiting for, the actual Xbox One console. It's foam on here to keep it safe. Just gotta pull it out. Try to get it. It's kinda hard. Brand new console. No, it's not pre owned. Almost got it. Just got to get the grips. It's hard. Almost got it. There we go. Just gonna pick it up. Out of the box. Crap. That's alright. Then take off these foam, this foam right here, find this, and it's the big finale. This is the front of the console. Brand new, pre-owned, well not pre-owned. Has Xbox right here on its logo. Has the place where the heat comes out. This time, it's a slide-in and not a tray. has the light-up button that turns on when the Xbox is on. And let me take off this little plastic right here. I'll set it down. Here. Move the box down here. Put the console in here. Pull off this. Pull off that. <coughs> That's what the console looks like. Big though, but that's fine. Has a whole bunch of heat removers. There's fans inside of here. There's another heat remover on the side. Then more heat removers on this side. And then on the back, this is another place where it beats the PlayStation 4. On the PlayStation 4, there's only one audio output. There is one. Two, two audio outputs. There's the power button. Well, the power box. There's a S slash PD IF. Mm -hmm. Two USB ports. That's on. I don't know what that is. Another out. Can, that's where the connect sensor is. And that's the whole. That's the back of the console. Here's more heat removers. 
and that's how that's the Xbox One unboxing. Then there might there is there's no more in the box. This is the Xbox One console. I will be making a review of it in action in a little bit. All right. Now I just need to set up everything. See, all right. See you guys. That was my first. That was my first unboxing, and see you guys next time in my second unboxing.